to Northern Ants. My name is Mark, and this is Miss Survival, version 0.5.0. It's in the beta branch. If you've not checked out the, any of the other parts, I would recommend going back and watching episode one first, and then I've got uh, two others also. Uh, I'll link them up in the I'll link the part one up in the description, just in case if you haven't seen it yet. I think the first thing that we're going to do is look into getting a blacksmith shop. We don't have to build the, the workbench because it was already here for us, which is really good. Uh, furnace, reload bench. Yeah, I think the blacksmith shop would look pretty good right here. Just got to get it turned right. Played, I had to restart, and I had a hammer. <laughs> Actually, I, I think about it, I might have had two. <laughs> now I have none, but oh well. Uh, let's see, want to get some other stuff started. We'll get them set up so that we can <clears throat> always uh, throw stuff in them as we get get the stuff. Yeah, let's see, <clears throat> need a drying rack. Campfire. Actually, campfire might be. Yeah, let's put the campfire over here by the door. Putting a campfire indoors is probably not <clears throat> the best idea, but there's no burn down your base feature in the game yet. <laughs> uh, let's see. Yeah, drying rack. <clears throat> the only problem with this is we need salt. And I've only found, like, one thing of salt so far. So. <clears throat> yeah, we're out of water, too. I think thirst is probably going to start becoming an issue. We do have a coal there, but... Let's add some rope to this. And yeah, we need sticks. So we gotta get branches for that to make sticks. Which we don't have branches, so. Yeah, let's throw some of the stuff in this uh, filing cabinet so we don't have it on us. It's always good to have as much of your inventory space open just in case if you find something. stones, toolboxes, get some trees cut down here, Whew, quick, hehe, <laughs> oh, I think that's a sign of a missed event happening off a distance, let's run up to the tower and see if we can't see any smoke. and there's another tower over that way you can see. But I'm 
not seeing any smoke. Oh, we need one of her saws. Okay, now we can make some more planks. I always hope that there's a mist isn't going to move in while we're making these planks and stuff. But being inside of our base, it's a little bit safer. I'm not really sure if the zombies can climb. Oh, we got a mist. Yeah, the mist didn't just come out of nowhere. I had to restart. And when I restarted, the mist kind of came on, on pretty quick. <laughs> As you can see, we do have another locker. A couple more lockers that I built. I did a log chopper so I can make uh, firewood for the campfire. Yeah, with the last record I had to I had to stop after a short time, so I went and did some more work on the camp, which you can see. I got a little bit more on the drying rack, I think, and I got a couple more lockers. I want to get the bow. I need a bucket because I'm looking to build a um, water purifier because I'm going to need water. I do have some dirty water, but the funny thing is, is this bottle. I so if you were wondering why I wasn't drinking that bottle of water, even though my thirst was really bad, it was because I had filled it with dirty water from the lake when I filled the bucket, and I didn't realize that it was it made it clean, and that's why I wasn't drinking it. So yeah, so that's why, <laughs> just in case if somebody was wondering. There it is, water purifier. Uh, I still need stones. I thought I had some stones somewhere around here. There's a couple, three. That's it. Oh, I had more than that. Boards. Huh. Oh, I used them for the campfire. Yeah, so the mists don't stick around very long. It rolled through pretty quick. Stone, stones. Yep, see there's one of the zombies. Nothing on him though, because I didn't kill him. There's some extra sticks when I need them. As you can see, I do have the vegetation off. Oh, there's a bear, 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 bear. <laughs> Other direction. Right now we're in the works for getting that water purifier set up. I think in the next episode we're gonna do some hunting. Yeah, it's hard enough to find the stones with the vegetation off. You have the... You can't even see them when the extra grass is there. It's like... 
I will eventually turn it back on, but right now it's kind of dire that I get a f source of water. There's a couple more zombies there. Good. We're gonna need bark for starting the fire and for getting the water purifier going too. For the water purifier you need matches and and bark. Yeah, my stamina goes down quick when you're dehydrated. is find a base where you're off the ground and I like the fact that mine's under those power lines because it's a way to find it again you ever get turned around all you have to do is look for the power lines and then follow them and you'll eventually come across your base <laughs> tree grown in the middle of the road I don't understand a small tree, depending on how long this, uh, the mist has occurred. But for a full-grown tree like that to be in the middle of the, you know, this thing would have had to have been happening for like 20 years. <laughs> yeah, let's just drink some of our water. Probably should have done that a long time ago, but... There we are. I don't know, we still have a little bit left, but... We want to make sure we get that water purifier up and running. Yes, no rocks anywhere. I think I need eight of them, I think. Thought that was a bear for a second. There was one, finally, a couple of them. so we want to make sure we pick up as many as we can. Yep, they're right here by our base. Yep, that's all we can carry. Let's get back and get that built. I like having the start of the blacksmith shop there from a distance it helps see where your base is at too. It's kind of like a beacon. suitcase too. Yeah, I did quite a bit between the end of the beginning of the, the episode and the end of the episode. I ran down to the lake and got some water. Perfect. Okay, we should be able to get this completely built. Okay, 
and now we have a bucket of dirty water in here. I probably that's okay. I I was trying to remember why I wasn't drinking that water, and it was because it was I had got it right out of the lake in the bottle when I got the bucket of water, so I thought it was dirty, and I checked it. And it was clean. That's why I had drink. I had drank it. Yeah, we got put. We'll put all ten liters in there. And now we need bark and matches. So we got some bark. Oh, we need four. Okay, we need one more. Which I think. Nope, not in there. No, no, uh, come on, uh, nope, not in that one either. I got, I gotta get some kind of way to label these. Yeah, here we go. Okay, we just grab it out of the, out of the campfire for right now. We don't have anything to, to, uh, split that in half. There, we got half in both. Now we should be able to get this fired up. Distill it. Okay, there we go. Now we got some fresh water starting up. I think that makes a good spot to let off the episode. Uh, we'll get. We're gonna need some more buckets. I want to get as much water, and we're gonna get one of those big water storage units too, so we can fill that. Thirst is something that would be good to not have to worry about, and then we can focus on food in the next episode. Okay, well, thank you so much for watching. I do really appreciate it. Remember to hit that like button and comment down below what you thought. Well, thank you so much for stopping by and watching one of my videos. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon so you know exactly when the next video comes out. I do offer a wide range of different kinds of videos, so check out the playlists and you might find something else that you like other than this kind of video you watched today. Thank you so much. Comment down below what you thought, or just say hi. Have a great rest of your day.